Good morning, YouTube. Real babes and I are clearing out of Casa de Campo and we are headed up to the northern part of the island. We will be in Arecibo for about two weeks. So we are enjoying a last minute soak in the pool and then we're gonna drive over the mountains to the northern part of the island. I was communing with the chickens and the furry cat. Now Real Babes wants a picture of us in front of the waterfall before we dip out of Casa de Campo. It went down a lot. It did. It's nice and clear now. We are getting ready to blow out, y'all. Real Babes is putting the last bit of trash away. And I think we're gonna drive straight over the mountains rather than around the coast. I'm gonna show y'all the waterfall one more time because that was my favorite part of this place. And that's about as low as it has been flowing since we've been here. Past few days it has been gushing with all the rain we got. It Goodbye, Casa de Campo. And we're not going over the mountain. We are, but not the route we wanted to take. We are, because we have to go back into Ponce to return the scuba tank, then we're going over the mountains. I know you're gonna miss these roads. <laughs> Look at farming practices, um, good sustainable farming practices. I was talking to her about like the area over in that area. We are getting ready to hit the road and I am seriously going to be bummed out. We're going to be farther away from Blue Water Scuba because we can get pretty much anything and everything we need there. I love that store. Back into the mountains and back into rain. It's Real Babe's music selection again. We are going to get some lesh on. Wow, that road gave away too. Wow. <laughs> oh, bottle. <laughs> the first Le Chonero was closed. Back into more of a thriving metropolis. Let's see it. Oh, I see some uh, heat lamps. Oh, it looks that like looks like it's, it's open. open. This is okay. a cute little town. We don't even know what town it is. Look, this town is so good. Anything with the dancing cactus playing guitar wearing his her brother is cool with me. I wonder if this town is big enough to have a little uh, downtown central area. We're about to find out. There's some Spanish colonial. So it is pretty old. You can tell by the architecture downtown here. And here we are at the little town square. Yeah, I'll turn. We'll see if we can't stop and get out a little bit. Check out this solar field, y'all. <laughs> oh, 
we got a view of the river and towns. No, I want the good stuff. I want the good stuff, yeah. We are eating Le Chon, and that is a slow roasted pork with Amarillo arroz, which is yellow rice. Sort of like peas and rice from Bahamas. Get, get the rice good too. Mm. Love you. Love you. Ridiculously good. So good. Smash mine. <laughs> you did. You're welcome to help. Uh huh. You ready, sexy? I did. I saw them. There's cockatiels. You can see them down here. See them? Down at the end in the cage. Aww. This is a lavanderia. Dry cleaner. Yeah. All the antique phones and everything. That is so cool. <laughs> there is another view of the solar field, y'all. Cool. He's wearing a mask. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah. That's a view. That? Is it Taino or Arawak? Proof that JB Weld fixes almost anything. Ooh, AC. That was the little town of Adjuntis. Adjuntis? Adjuntis, I believe. And we are really digging it. We're still in town. Oh, there's even a coffee shop. You want some caffeine? <laughs> you want to get out and do the bean? Oh, look at the barista. She looks totally stoked, too. We should totally do some bean. And there's the square to the left. Oh, there's another samurai. I love the Real Babes has a custom-built samurai coming. And we've been seeing a ton of samurais. We are in Valle Verde, which is Green Valley, and it is definitely lush and green. The road on the hill we are currently climbing is covered in mud. It looks like they've had some mudslides. Yeah. We are back on Highway 10. We are obviously not back on Highway 10. Somebody decided to take the scenic route. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Somebody. Oh, no. We are turning back around to get back on the 10 because it turns out this is Route 123, which we absolutely love, but we don't want to spend about an hour and a half driving on tight one lane roads like this. The vistas up here are pretty darn incredible. But Real Babes doesn't really care for these little roads. No. No me encanta. Oh, that is incredible. Had a bunch of big mudslides, and this one, look at the size of that boulder! Wow. Oh, I love it. This is the biggest and most heavily traveled road between Ponce and Arecibo. It has a whole two lanes. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Most places it has two whole lanes. Oh, big truck. Get scared, baby. Oh! Uh -huh. ah! Are these switchbacks are no joke. Oh, but you're in the middle of the jungle. I mean, this mm. is beautiful. Real Babes and I just spotted one of the most amazing waterfalls we've ever seen. It is huge. Um, and we are trying to get there, but we're dealing with a lot of mudslides and stuff like that. 
it's absolutely amazing. We have no clue what this is. Is it rock or is it poured concrete? Interesting. Don't know what it is. Okay, we found another waterfall. This is one, two, three. You know, we might be taking a different route. Y'all see it ahead of us right there? Here's the split off. The rivers are definitely getting a lot bigger, y'all. Check this out, y'all. Now, we are rerouting because Real Babe's phone tried to direct us down this road. And I'm gonna show y'all where this road goes. Nowhere. <laughs> I'm even gonna get out. This was a bridge. Now there's not a bridge. And y'all can see right there to here, this is where the bridge was. Now, this road that we're gonna continue along is pointed in pretty much the direction we need to go. So that's what we're gonna do. We're on no time constraints today and we're gonna go explore a little y'all. We just hit a ginormous cemetery. Oh wow, we can drive into it. It is raining, so we're gonna take this from the car y'all. We have rain jackets, we're just being pretty slack today. I will roll down the window. Wow. Absolutely massive. Apparently the roads are washed out all over the place, y'all. So we're gonna turn around again. That's a mongoose! There's a mongoose right there! Okay, I can see him out the window actually. Oh, somebody's honking at me. Right there. Okay. I don't know. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, he's under the car. He's coming out on your side, Laura. Unless he's directly under us. I don't see him. That is a moment. Yeah. It's definitely something. There he goes right there. Give it to me. Right there. Hi, Mongoose. There he's running. Wow, oh, you saw your first Mongoose. <laughs> Real Babes just had her first Mongoose encounter. I don't know how much of the Mongoose I got on film. We'll figure that out when we edit. Um, but yeah, we are once again headed in the direction of Arecibo or Arecibo but we keep running into washed out roads and washed out bridges. We weren't able to get on 10 from here. Show them the on-ramp. The on-ramp is right there. Yeah, I think it's gonna be gone. I think you're right. <laughs> Let's I, go I feel find like we, out. We already figured that out, but we'll, I mean, we'll see. We, yeah, we still, we can parallel 10 and get an on-ramp somewhere. Yeah. Ella Bayarde? I think that's one of the towns we were told about. Big river. And it's going to get bigger the closer to the coast we get. We are back on the 10, y'all. We are starting to get into steep, sheer rock ridges and a lot more actual rock outcroppings. This was actually blasted through this stuff. So this is gonna be ass. Yeah. They cut their, these, this is really weird, like finger rock formations. Real tall, thin ridges. Well, y'all can see the Atlantic Ocean. Everything we were looking at before was the Caribbean. And now we are coming down to the coastal plain on the north side of the island. And that is Arecibo down there. The closer to the coast you are, the higher the population density. And we are pretty much getting right back into town again. There is a Puebla supermercado in town. And they have an awesome little like steam table buffet. So we're gonna be eating there for sure. I'm stoked they have one in town. 
town looks pretty well decked out with like everything we're gonna need we are getting close to the latest accommodations is it right here yeah okay we are here red white and blue it is up here comes another rooster buddy every single airbnb we've gotten so far has come with at least one chicken if not multiple chickens and a cat or multiple cats oh look there's a bunch of chickens running okay youtube this is going to be our base camp for the next like two weeks oh we got remote controls for lights <laughs> bingo here is the kitchen here's the fridge we're about to load all our groceries up in here Here's bedroom number one. Wow. It's a lot bigger than it looks online. Yeah, these ceilings are huge. This has got to be a super old building. Well, you can tell from the architecture outside. The bathroom is, hello, <laughs> pretty dang dope. I'm excited. This is nice. Yeah. Oh, is this the laundry? No, this is the other bedroom. Okay, I think we are gonna set up house and start adventuring around Arecibo some. We got checked in and we met the host and they invited us up for some pizza and beers. So I'm gonna get some batteries charged and Real Babes and I are gonna run up there and get to know the host. I think Real Babes and I are gonna go check out our front a little bit. We have decided to walk up to the beach while we're waiting on dinner. 16. <laughs> Big dog, little dog. It sounds like they've actually got some surf. We're gonna see what kind of swell they got. Oh, yeah, they do have surf. Great. Looks like a decent little break. Like a really good break. Oh, you smell that. Sharing chickens, Laura. Yeah, that's the whole point of holding the keys. <laughs> we are heading up to dinner. Okay, this is the upstairs of Beautiful. Welcome. Oh, wow. Y'all got a great view up here. Yes. So, can you take a picture? I sure can. Um, I generally don't drink. Yeah. But he's having one right now, so. Yeah, I'm having a beer, but then I'll probably switch to something. Right. Sure, yeah. Okay. Hi. Mm -hmm. Responded. I mean, you see, like, take this lagoon here. Okay. You know, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. So that's all uh, mangroves, it looks like. Uh huh. Okay. All around, you got a caiman all, all over there. I am still wrapping these videos up and there is just so much that I don't remember from a few days ago. That mongoose was super cool. Um, wish we could have got closer to that waterfall, but uh, like y'all saw in the videos, tons of washed out roads, tons of washed out bridges, lots of mudslides, rock slides, all that stuff. We are still in Arecibo and we are going to be here for a few weeks at least. Um, Real Babes is upstairs socializing with Alejandra and Luis. I am doing some editing and I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. I think we're going to Barceloneto. But like always, y'all are coming with us. Love y'all and we will see y'all soon.